Hello everybody, welcome back to Dodgeman Plays Dead Cells. Our last run wasn't great, I'm not gonna lie. But we're starting to get we're starting to get somewhere, I think. Maybe a little bit more reliably. So we'll see how it goes this time. Um Oh no, that was not not a good start. This, this lightning ability, I think, is really cool on the first floor. But beyond that, it's it takes too long to charge up. Excuse me, don't do that. Yeah, you can just get toasted. So where are we going? I'm quite excited. They have... Um, Motion Twin has now teased a new biome in the next update. So I'm looking forward to that. Oh, Biter ability. So that's how we're going, is it? I'm... As anyone who's watched this before knows, I am always down for a minion build. Thousand gold for the ability to kick people off walls probably not worth it. Although, I'll take the whip over the lightning bolt every time. Um, excuse me. You, get out of my sight. The, the one, <laughs> the one thing about this whip, rather than the other one, it does huge damage, but only in a very, very specific range. Where's this going to take me? Hi. Broadsword? Nah. I'm still okay with the, the one we've got right now. Take that as well. Because why not? No, I definitely don't want to kick anyone. And that's not true. But over the whip, no. Come on. A lot of money so far. And a skill up. Cool. Reduce damage by 30%. That is pretty solid. Got, we'll get plenty of money actually. We'll definitely take that for now. Will we take Knife Storm? So let's. It oils 149 damage on that oiled sword. And there's two of these. Nah, you know what? We'll, st we'll skip that for now. But I will take Knife Storm. Because the victims release a swarm of biters. Which is exactly what we want. So we can have two swarms of biters. Look at that! And you can just wreck face. And um, that's exactly the same as the one I've got. Hello. Thank you. This definitely has to go into strength. There's nothing up there, was there? No. Ooh, another paid door. I definitely think I. Oh no, that's the that's the brands. We've had the brands before. We don't want those. And you can get stuffed as well. I would have taken the cursed treasure if I'd found it earlier on this floor, but we're almost done. Ah, magnetic grenade. Do we want to take that over at the knife storm? To hold things in place while the biters... Yeah, we'll do it. Our, um... Yep. Is that it? Okay. Where do we want to go? 
Prom do we want to go to the toxic sewers? Rather than the old sewers? I don't know, actually. I'm kind of at a bit of a loss as to where we should be heading next. Let's go this way. We'll just investigate. Where are you taking me? Oh yeah, <laughs> the Austrian, no. We don't want to go that way. No, I'm going to skip the heart this time. Uh, no. We'll go back this way. No, ah. Uh. So yeah, I think this is the one that goes to the old... Oh no, it is the toxic source. Cool. So I think I did make the right call. That's alright. We'll toxic sewers up. Let's go. What are we looking for? We've only got 17 cells. Uh, no, I'm not really, I'm not really sold on any of these, to be perfectly honest. Um, we'll work on the heavy crossbow for a bit. Why not? Deep, deep sewers. Uh, I didn't actually use my heels at all. This is good. It's a good sign. All right. That. Get. Can the biters even get to them from there? I'm, I guess not. I can though. Yeah. Get bited. I wonder actually if we can if we can magnetize these things into place and then keep them at critical distance for the oops. No, that's not gonna help anybody. Sure. Ow. Ow! Get off of me! I don't like that at all. Um, this is a better sword than the one we've got, right? No, not at double damage received. So this floor hasn't started as well as the last one went. Let's just put it that way. I do like the magnetic grenades. I really do. Uh, health upgrade, that will do me. Uh, just, just walk away, son. Walk away. Yep. Biters. I'm telling you, every time, biters are unstoppable. I should have taken the firebrands, because then we combine that with the biters, we can keep our distance and just do crazy DPS. Okay, so where are we going? I want to go back. Maybe not, I think we, we did just do a big circle, but... It wasn't quite as accidental as, as I thought it was. Cool. Yeah, we need to get closer to them than that. This magnetic build, 
I'm telling you that, oops. The, um, there's definitely something in it. I like that. That was lucky as well. Oh, no, no, don't do that. Don't do that. What is poisoning them? None of these weapons that I've got do poison damage, do they? No, they don't. The magnetic grenade does damage to a poison target, but it doesn't actually poison the target itself. So that was that was kind of silly. Ah, oh, that was even more silly. Get out of there! That was embarrassing. And I take this as a skill upgrade this time. So our biters can do more damage. Another health upgrade. Get lost. I don't really like either of our weapons right now. But I do like our abilities. That's why I'm not, I'm not really using my sword that much. This is not, it's not the ideal setup for me. So hopefully we'll find a better, better weapon soon. Um, do I really want to go that way? Yep. Get out of there. Yeah, so we'll take the infantry bow over the whip. So we've now got more poison damage. Um, yep. Does actually quite a decent amount of damage too. That was actually kind of impressive. Um, yeah, the infantry bow is good. Now, do, do I want to go to the ramparts? Where else is that? I don't know the routes from here. Yeah, I like that. Got this. So now we just need to work on something that does poison damage. Nice. Oh, hi. Huh. Enemies release a toxic cloud when they die. That would be good for the poison damage, but we don't do shields. Screw you, shield meta. Come on, sword. That is not sword. Hmm. The the flammable oil on that meat grinder is pretty tempting. It's a lot of damage. Let's take that over the biter. Sorry, biters. been good but it's time for to try something new Ooh, nutcracker firebrands that is the perfect combo isn't it that's flammable oil from the meat grinder plus 100 percent damage and a burning target there we go that's oh yeah let's do it 
I was going to take the Nutcracker for the Biter Swarm that comes out of it. But this, I think, will be much better. This. Oops, that's, that's the wrong button. Get born. Yeah, that went pretty well. We got the we got the old flammable oil again, but we can skip that. Um can I uh, can hit him, good. That's pretty deadly. Is there another scorpion up here? No, apparently not. I thought the green bit in the floor was scorpion. So I think we've got a reasonable setup here. We're doing a lot of DPS right now. Like a lot. That's some. That is some. No, I'm not gonna take your cursed treasure. That still looks like it's an insane amount of damage. It really does. There's so many of these. Where's it taking me? Where's... Okay, so that's the old sewers. So where's the other one taking me? Oh, just to the weapon. Knife storm. No. Not quite so interested in that one. Time to go then, I guess. Um, ramparts. Ramparts are... Yeah. Why not? We still haven't faced a major boss in the ramparts, have we? 33 cells. So we can unlock the heavy crossbow here. Let's do it. And then more healing potion. Oh, it did give us that as well. It's a bit slow. Prefer the infantry one, I think. Although, 630 damage is crazy. But the range, the range is the problem, yeah. Skip. Heal me. Heal me! Stop trying to heal me and heal me. Alright. So let's see. The, the problem I've had with builds like this in the past is the biters are only good on the ground, and the, the meat grinder is only good on the ground. And there's a lot of flying enemies up here. So hopefully, that will balance out with the magnetic grenade. Oh! Crap. Oh. oh, he got me! What a son of a bitch. Well, that was annoying. Yeah, that kind of DPS I can live with. Still not quite where I'd like to be though. But it does actually help if we remember the fire too. The fire is a big part of this build. Let's 
Excuse me. How dare you? Yeah. That's the way. Now, the skills. What are we doing? Yeah, so that, that's more or less what I hoped for. F the fire damage by itself is almost enough to kill most of these guys. Yeah, see that? All I need to do is just hit him and then he'll just die. Um, it does help if you remember to press the correct button, Paul. The correct button. Look at that! That's insane! Wait for that to pop. And throw. Bon, bon, bon. It's all bon and it's all getting a bit framey. Actually, not too bad. Yeah, we've got that. Look at that. I am loving this. Okay, Firebrands 3 throws it in the axe, doesn't arrow upwards. Well, I mean, it's, it is moderately better, I guess. What is this? Does this have any kind of fire effect? Nope. Goodbye. Where are we going now? Oh, we can still go down, okay. Hi! Oh, the flaming sword. That could be better than the brands though. Because it does immediately set fire to stuff. So let's let's try it. At least I assume it immediately sets fire to things that are covered in flammable oil. I want to go back for that kebab. Delicious. So, I mean, that wasn't exactly what I had in mind. But... Okay, so we get the we get the biter effect still, so that's that's something. Hmm. It's not really doing what I thought it was gonna do. Oh. A rare vampirism. If that doesn't heal us for every hit we get on an enemy, I will eat my non existent hat. I don't wear a hat, but if I did, I would eat it if I'm wrong. Ow. Just need to die. You closed like 20 minutes ago. <laughs> okay. So I want that, I want to finish this level now. So I can get the blueprint. God damn it. Uh, where are we going next? Okay, that was subpar, but okay. Let's go more skills. Let's go full, full skills. What 
what's what is all that stuff over there? Oh, it's the behind the time door. Never mind. I obviously missed another bow as well. What have you got? Uh, da, da, da. Enemies burn when they die. Perfect. So we've gone full fire build. It's... Oh, hi. Can I shoot you in the foot? No. That's okay. Like a Legolas style bowman ship here. I have all the bow skills. Um, okay. You. Born when you die, set fire to all the stuff. Okay. This is perfect. Sort of. It's not quite perfect, okay. We'll try that again. It's not quite as powerful as the brand was. But we're getting somewhere. And to be honest, as long as the enemies die before we actually get to them, I'm okay with that. Hmm. So there's... There's a lot of these downward roads that don't seem to go anywhere. So I, I need to think about that. Maybe open the assault with an arrow. N not when I can't reach them, of course. What we do? That works out here too. Yeah. This is going incredibly well. I'm a bit worried. Everything that I do causes something else to happen now. It's pretty amazing. Ah, that's not what I wanted to happen. But I mean, that kind of is. Yeah, that's exactly the kind of crazy ass explosion I wanted. This is insane. Lovely. I'm not really sure what else I can say about this other than the fact that it's pretty spectacular. Yeah. I've got biters everywhere, I've got fire everywhere. Oh, I guess that's us done. gives us that blueprint which is awesome I don't know if this build uh, recover 4.2 per melee hit for six seconds ah so it's an ability okay 75% extra damage that is a really really good skill I'm gonna take that definitely start working towards that and we'll unlock it in the next run I guess I don't know how good this build is going to be against the boss on the Black Bridge. I really don't. But I guess we're about to find out. Still can't get away with how pretty this damn level is. Hi. 
I guess this, uh, the arrow is not going to be that much use. Oh yeah. That was actually not too bad. How can he still be have the ammo stuck in him? I've rolled past him two or three times now. Come on. Oh, that was that was not the right ability to use there. Okay. Oh no, wrong choice, wrong choice. Yeah, it's the jumping we want to. Started off pretty well. Now we're messing it up. Something fierce. He's done. That went a lot better than I expected, to be honest. Amazing. Getting to the stage where I can safely beat that boss now. It says. I didn't realize that was an actual thing. I don't want this this time, but... Great. And then we'll stick the rest in there. Because it'll have to... Wait. Releases poisonous gra... gra uh, it releases a cloud of poisonous gas and covers the ground in flammable oil. That's insane. Probably better than the grenade now, isn't it? Let's try it. What could possibly go wrong? So I still haven't found any new enemies in Um, this is not the right ability. I am not good enough at this game for this ability yet. But, I always like lifesteal. That was an impressive shot. And the ability to heal myself on like trash mobs like that, super useful. Um, get lost. Get lo- uh, Oh, I'm out of ammo, okay. Oh no! I am totally impressed with how I pulled that off. Thirty one hundred to increase my skills again. Hmm. Fan Prism 5. 5.4. 5.9 is not really that much. Although, igniting the ground around me could be much more useful than that. Okay, and then we'll take this as well. And it goes into skills. I don't know what the maximum level actually is. And I'm kind of assuming it stops at 9. It doesn't look like it was... Uh, I don't think those boxes are, those shapes are big enough. Oh, crap. I don't think they're big enough for um, double figures. Yeah, we're done. I like the fact that that just killed a whole bunch of stuff I didn't even know was there. much damage that's doing. Oh, we are on it. 
Vampirism, I'm not sure. I'm still not sold, but I like how this we can do this. That's that makes me happy. I'm sorry. The bleeding. The DPS. So far, so pretty spectacularly epic. Look at it. And then we get fire damage in there as well. I'm telling you, it's a perfect skill set. Bleeding. Fire damage. Yeah. Oh, get out of it! Jesus! How did that happen? Well, who knows, but it, I know it did. But that was good. We unlocked something new, and that's always fun. So if, if you enjoyed the video, think about dropping me a like or leaving a comment, because it all helps. And of course, subscribe if you want to see more in the future. But until next time, thanks for watching.